will not forget there are eight words that I want you to remember for the rest of your life as the key to humility the A part but thou shall remember the Lord thy God but thou shall remember not just the Lord thy God hear me one of the greatest keys to humility is remembrance remember where God took you from and remember who took you if you can remember where God took you from and you can remember who took you you have mastered the key to beating life at its game believe me when David stood before Goliath Goliath said am I a dog that you are coming to me with this sling he said God who delivered me I remember success has a way of eroding your memory that's why there are certain pains and certain things that you are around you is looking for favor and you can never hear people who tell you the truth again times will come you will have to be your own counselor let yesterday be your counselor remember how God lifted you man of God remember once upon a time you had no church no reputation politician remember once upon a time you trekked without shoes every time men forget they stop moving forward remember 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 this is what I do all the time let me speak to someone here keep the memory of your pain now you will need it tomorrow don't waste your pain your pain is a miracle the scar listen the injury on your hand today is what will keep you when you sit on the throne till today Jesus still has the scar the scar reminds him of his love for man again every time you see that scar you remember every time God did wondrous things to the nation of Israel listen to me he gave them instructions he says find a way of archiving this if your children ask you and say why are you doing this tell them oh Israel you forgot too soon that for 430 years you were in the land of slavery now you began to build idols one of the ways that God brings men to humility when they forget him is to lift his hand and you will see what the devil does in your life every time people were proud he gave them over to their enemies it's in your Bible Africa could this be why we are going through what we are going through Nigeria could this be why we are going through if my people who are called by my name what's the first thing they do not pray not pray we have been praying we have been praying humble themselves it is not because the arm of the Lord is too short man of God it does not take God anything to expand your ministry it does not take anything for the anointing you desire if it's prosperity I dare to tell you there are enough destiny helpers enough ideas enough systems and structures for God to lift you read your Bible and see the lifting power of God when you become at the center stage of your life forget about the hand of God I remember remember your goodness I remember remember your love I remember remember your faithfulness I remember remember your grace I remember a time in my life when I was going to preach no bike no nothing it was raining I remember trekking in the rain while the rain was pouring on me I was praying in tongues and going for the meeting and look what he's done today and then you forget keep that memory that's what God will use to remind you oh Bologna remember that one time you were soaking Gary and you drink and say to dine 
to the Lord be all the glory but today you have chains of restaurants around the world oh let it never enter your heart oh God anything you give me let it stay outside me sit in your position alone jealously guarded by my passion for you don't think I wasted your time tonight I gave you the key to the next level some of you as a company you need to do this go back to God tomorrow when you go to work tell the people to excuse you a bit lock that door and kneel down and say father you may even need to pray your local dialect maybe it will give you room to express it more and say God of heaven you are the one who has shown me mercy forgive me if for any reason I joined an association of unwise people and I started forgetting you in the name of celebrating success be careful with some of these groups and associations they, are, they may not be wrong but we must be careful because some of them mislead us into feeling embarrassed that is the Lord once upon a time you could not afford a good shoe but now you can even buy the whole boutique oh please do not forget thou shall remember remember yesterday and remember the Lord remember yesterday and remember the Lord take this message and give anybody you know and you love sincerely use it to train your children if God has blessed you and you are a blessed man with substance sit your children down don't just show them the money tell them the stories tell them young boys you have the privilege to eat anything you eat today and travel around the world but it was not always like that I came from a family where we had to use well to use well to draw water out God began to help me if the only thing I give you people is money I've destroyed you this is a mistake and I say it finally before we pray most leaders in Africa and Nigeria are making this mistake we are not giving those who look up to us the stories we are only giving them the rewards so a young man now does not know that ministry needs stamina and endurance and pain why because he just came and received impartation received maybe three or five cars and had his mentor or spiritual father come and stand as a leverage to speak for him an increase is coming and he can look and be laughing at people and say shame on you five years no membership because of that leverage pain is a gift make sure you give those you really love don't inflict pain on them the testimony of your pain i mean share it with them let them know that once upon a time you fasted and prayed that this anointing did not just drop because you read your bible and tell them the privilege you now enjoy do not abuse it carelessness comes when process is not known when people ignore process the result is carelessness i'm going to give us two three minutes i don't know how you are going to cry before god i will do my own here the next two three minutes you are just going to say Lord if ever my heart is lifted forgive me show me mercy tonight and grant me grace pray you don't have to kneel down or lie down just cry before your maker please no movement around this is a serious moment go ahead and pray remember in one minute remember where his majesty took you from dear man of God 
their apostle and their prophet their pastor and their evangelist their politician their academician their millionaire their billionaire their elder statesman their father their parent remember where he took you from their student their great man thank you jesus oh thank you jesus thank you jesus for your mercy for your goodness thank you if you have to cry cry if you have to sing sing just a minute or two and we're done let him know that i am still your boy oh god I'm still the one you lifted. I'm still the one you helped. I'm still the one you blessed. I'm here to say how much I love you. I'm here to say how much i adore you lord i'm not here to complain about my many struggles by your spirit and your grace i'm confident you'll solve them but i'm here 